I would like to greet all the authorities present here and to take this opportunity to welcome the new Secretary General Matthias Korman. The ULAC Foundation was created 10 years ago by the heads of the state of the European Union and the community of Latin American and Caribbean states. It is a tool of the partnership between the two regions and its activities feed into the intergovernmental dialogue, a continuous dialogue. The ULAC Foundation was entrusted with the mission of strengthening and promoting the partnership between the two regions, enhancing its visibility and fostering active participation of the civil society in, in, in its activities. I am grateful for the opportunity to take part of this anniversary celebration of the OECD Latin American and Caribbean Regional Program. It is an honor for the Foundation uh, to be part of its steering committee, confirming the common interest in the bi-regional partnership between uh, Europe, Latin America and the Caribbean. Over the years, the Yeulac Foundation has maintained a very productive relationship with the OECD, especially through joint initiatives uh, with the, its uh, development center, which have resulted in various publications and seminars and things uh, uh, very useful for the community. Since the beginning of the pandemic, the ULAC Foundation has been promoting the generation and exchange of knowledge through the conduct of studies and the organization of interdisciplinary and multi-stakeholder debates based on knowledge and perspective that experts offer on topics related to the sustainable, inclusive and resilient recovery. The Latin America and Caribbean region has been hit very hard by the crisis triggered by the pandemic and together with the OECD and other organizations, governments, civil society entities, we've been uh, highlighting the importance of the development in transition narrative to be taken in the context, context of such recovery. This crisis is an opportunity for the uh, countries of the region to recreate public goals and development policies in line, for example, with the UN 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development. We have been working on initiatives to strengthen women's participation, for, uh, for example, in circular economy and other very important issues. The Foundation has been dedicated also to highlighting the importance of the multilateral cooperation, which according to every country of both regions is not an option, but a necessary and more equal, more resilient uh, uh, instrument for a better world. Finally, I would like uh, to reaffirm our interest in continuing to strengthen uh, the increasingly strategic relationship between the OECD and the region with a view also to contribute to the implementation of the 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development in the region. Thank you and good luck. <laughs>